Welcome to Entrepreneurs Are Leaders podcast with Harry Sardinas. Interviews with world's most influential entrepreneurs that share tips about how to grow your business exponentially. Charismatic speaking, leadership, branding, marketing strategies designed to help you monetize your knowledge, find true happiness and manifest your goals and dreams. How would you like to record and publish your own music and also uh, your book? Today we have a special guest from India. So can you please introduce yourself? Thank you, sir, for inviting me on the show, first of all. Myself, Mayangangba, I'm the founder and CEO of Genius Words. I'm also the executive producer and lead host of the Dear Parijat podcast show. It is it has been listened in 17 plus countries and do Genius Words, we are basically a book publishing and music publishing firm. So that's how uh, my story was. And later on, we'll discuss the more important points about it. So let's talk about the... the the music part of it, right? So how come you started in, in publishing in music, music publishing? Yeah, it's also free of course, first of all, I would like to say, whatever services we provide to Genius Words, these are free of course for our customers, these are free of course for the artists and authors. Secondly, most important thing that I want to say is, music publishing is started with somehow on the book projects itself. There was a book called Artistic Yogi, which I written, it was the first non-fiction book which I wrote. It is on the journey of a change maker, Mr. Murit Pathak. So while working on the promotions of this project, we thought of why not to create a song on this, a motivational song. So I reached out to a fellow artist that is Grant, and we created out, we worked on creating a, a song that is Artistic Yogi. Later on, the director of Genius World, that is Mr. Prakha Chitavanshi, and he's a He's an amateur artist. He's an amateur singer. He writes song, but he didn't used to upload it or didn't used to publish it uh, recently. Or So what I did was I tried to connect with him. I tried to say, bro, you have this talent and you should just do this. So we agreed. We did the proper research and planning. And then we introduced to the music publishing. And there were two songs which we released. Those are live on 200 pitch stores. The first one is Tera Saath, Angar. And then we have... Uh, Kinara, which launched recently in the month of February. So how you distribute these songs after you produce it? Where do you put it? We basically use the free distribution aggregators. Like there are many aggregators, as you can say. Uh, uh, when we talk about Amuse, there are platforms like Amuse, Distocate, etc. Amateur. So there are multiple platforms to distribute this. Basically, there's a thing, there's a lack of knowledge, there's a lack of expertise. Like there are most of the issues when you face in the terms of copyrights. Like, as you can see, there are many copyrighted tracks which we can't use or we need to follow the perfect uh, details and also we follow the whole procedure. We follow the user, combines the expertise, knowledge and resources to put this into use. And the promotions are, of course, done by the part of Genius Works. We do it, we do it with, uh, press releases and also the featuring in magazines, podcasts, etc. That's how we do it. But the music is created by you guys, so you shouldn't have any copyright issue, right? Definitely, we have our own copyrights. Uh, copyrights are on the name of the artist itself. That created the music, yeah? Yeah, and that's then, how we go for it. And then you distribute it about that. So now tell, tell me a little bit more about your book, about your first book. Yeah, definitely. The first book is very uh, interesting book. It's about the artistic youths. It's a journey of a boy from a small town, Pili uh, It's a, He was a boy who went through a lot of things like he even tried to commit suicide many times in his life and later on he become eight plus world record holders that is the story of a modded pattern that's an inspiring story i would like to say uh in the book there are many uh, phases of life like he even suffered in the love story then he wrote a, one of the most talked about book that is Faish. so that book is being very famous in here in, in india itself and in many parts of the world so i was inspired basically by his book the first time I read his book, Khaish, that's how I was inspired about uh, reading his journey, reading his story. And that's how in the book itself, it's not just a personal memoir. It's not a personal memoir at all. It's the journey of a change maker. How a person who was so disappointed at a phase, who rose from depression, from ashes to the stars. So that's how the things are. We talk about the various points, how to win at life, how to succeed at life. And can you, just, you can just imagine it. What kind of that personality would be who went to such situations and now he's shining itself in the world. He have recently completed many fellowships. He have won many awards in India, like 
he is a great person that's a great story i would i have covered in that book that's how it was so how many books have you wrote uh actually i have been a uh, editor compiler in many of the books i uh, like there was a book of matsubishi magagola i was the the gentleman i was the editor of it i have been the translator of the book of mr duke lord he is the international best selling author uh, the book was 100 lessons for a successful interracial relationship i have been a translator i have translated the book into hindi i have written artistic yogi i have written euphoria i have written tales of wonder back time tales of wonder i have written uh there are two more books of the children stories pogo and momo and there's a book called tim tim the story of a boy it's the story covering the autism but it's a child uh, children's book so it is uh, describing the autism in a poetic manner kind of say it is one of the first book i would say in the whole world in uh, written on this matter in this particular pattern so that's how it was and the most talked about book is uh, which i have written with mr deep lord that is never what we want to say it has been launched in june 1st 2024 recently and we have done a book signing event recently in usa the more book signing events are coming up soon we are going to reveal it later <laughs> yeah. and then read the, the, the music so anybody that create their own song everybody that create their own motivational song they can quote you guys and you can help them to produce the song and to distribute the songs yeah definitely that's how we do it uh, you can reach out to us at any way we are available uh, 24/7 for all the people out there we love to have the people and that's how we do it's and free of course there's no expenses for it can you make any money in royalties doing this yeah we do earn a part of the royalties from this because when the author earns the income when the artist earns the income can only be takes a share from it till the time there's, there's no direct expense for the artist there's no direct cost to them we manage all the press release we manage all the public uh, like you can do the pr and promotions and all the marketing as you know the marketing takes a lot of efforts and all the graphic designing the patterns and all we have to do all the task for them and we manage it all we are so proud to do it so are you a musician do you know how to sing do you know how to play an, an instrument no 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 i'm just an amateur lyricist yeah i don't have that uh, vocals god gifted but yeah i'm a lyricist i write mostly I uh, write many songs. Like there are songs which are in the progress right now, which will be released soon, which I've written. And I'm a poet myself. I'm an international author and poet, so that's all oh, we do. Wow! But do you write in English or in your own language? Ah, uh, I'm a bilingual. Ah, uh, I'm a multilingual author. I write in English as well as Hindi. So there are my books wow. in Hindi. There are my books in English. Both of them. Oh wow! Ah, fantastic. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. And. Any last message that you want to say to everybody there that I thinking that oh I have a winning song uh, that I can take to to the market uh, but I don't know where to start what is the last message that you have for them First of all I would like to say whatever you do do it with full dedication do it with full uh, con uh, connect with this particular story connect with your inspiration make your inspiration make your goal and just follow the goal stick to that particular thing stick to that particular thing even if you fail even if you fail today even if you fail tomorrow even if you fail thousand times just stand up rise again and just wait for that one day when you are successful you have to just do all this hustle just for that one day when you are when you can say yeah we did it that's how it is mm-hmm. secondly i would like to say if you want to know about the philosophy of life there's a book called remember what we want to say it is written by uh, duke lord we have written this book there are many important lessons for the people to learn about uh, it's a philosophy of life different laws which are the laws of universal acceptance these are laws are not bounded by any particular country and particular reason like these are not biased laws like how to live a life like there are emotions there are various phases how to overcome them how to guide the people who are facing these phases and you know there's a lot of things in the society so we have created the laws of universal acceptance that's how this book is if you want you can check it out it's available on amazon barnes and noble baker dollar everywhere like yeah thank you so much maya maya that's all what i want to thank you so much for joining our podcast and for you all listening i see you in our next episode of entrepreneurs are leaders bye for now thank you sir thank you for this opportunity hope you have a great day Follow us for more on charismatic speaking, leadership, exponential business growth, branding, marketing, strategies designed to help you monetize your knowledge, find true happiness and manifest your goals and dreams.